There may be times where a teacher wants to save a screen that a student has been browsing for future reference. And this is sometimes spotted from either device view or tab view. But while looking at the larger screen image, there's the button for save screen. The message at the top says it's been successfully saved. And now that we will be part of the student history that can be reviewed again later. And that can happen for multiple students at whatever point in time throughout a class that needs to be done. So if the student uh, goes to another site, let's switch back to thumbnail view. And we want to come in here and save this one again. We'll hit the Save Screen button. In another video, we'll look at how to access that history. Um, but the one quick place is right here, on, right near the Save Screen button itself. And it's this tab that says Saved Screens that shows the thumbnails that were saved. And those are available for review after class as well.